In this video, we'll walk you through how to make a design request on your KIMP 360 board. You have two options here. If you have some details, but not all of the details to submit a design request, you can add a card to the drafts list. Or if you're ready to go ahead and you have all your details on hand, just click add card in the request list. This will take you to the guided request form. In the guided request form, if you have any template saved from previously submitted requests that you'd like to choose from, you can use the drop down at the top of the form to select a template. This will pre-fill some of the fields for you. Otherwise, you can start filling in the fields yourself. So let's start with the task name. As you fill in the task name, you'll notice that Kim 360s AI will populate the design type in the drop down and generate options for fields like dimensions, output file formats, and source file format. If you don't want to go with Kim's recommendation for either of the formats, please feel free to switch those as you see fit. After that, you can choose to add a new brand and provide us with all of the brand guidelines that you need us to follow for this design request. Or if you've already created brands, you can choose from the brand dropdown to share with us the particular brand you'd like us to design for. Next, we'll need you to add a detailed description. The more detailed your design request description is, the better. This will help us with getting as close as possible to the design that you're looking for. Here are a few pointers on what to include. What type of design are you looking for? Is there a specific style or look and feel that you want? Let us know what your goal is with your design. And is there anything in particular that we should emphasize? Here's an example. I need a landing page designed that has a very energetic and vibrant look and feel. My health and fitness brand is all about encouraging people to eat healthier with fun, friendly messaging, and we want that to come across in the imagery font and colors used. My target audience is 20 to 30 something year old young professionals, and I wanna use this landing page to help create brand awareness and collect leads. So please make sure that the logo, brand name, slogan, and CTA are very prominent on the landing page. After the description, you'll provide us with any text content that your design should include. If you have text content, you'll just select this box and you'll have two options. You can either type out your text in the comment field below, or you can upload your text in an editable file. Now we do need it to be an editable file from which we can extract the text by copying and pasting it to save time and ensure that you have the fastest possible turnarounds and to avoid any unnecessary errors. After adding the text, there are two more fields. The next being additional assets, where you can upload or select specific assets for this design. Uh, so when it says select specific assets, that means that you can actually choose from your brand uh, files if you've got branded imagery that you've already uploaded to a brand. And we've also got reference files next, which are um, files or images that you want your design team to use as inspiration or take reference from when they're working on this design request. Once you've added all of these details, provided instructions related to these additional assets or reference files as well, you can either choose to save your request as a draft or you can hit publish to send it to the request list.